Hello, Keller Williams. It's Fred Moore here with another command tutorial video. In today's video, what I want to cover is something within designs that I'm sure a lot of you have already seen, but if you haven't, it's very simple to do, and that's to create a super hyper local video that you can share with your database or to the people that live in the area. So what we're going to do right off the bat is dive into command agent.kw.com and head over into our designs applet. So right here on the left hand side, over at designs. And then we're going to see everything that we've created in our library. And we'll come down to the bottom right hand side and click the plus button. And then we're going to click video and next. Now we can search for a neighborhood here. It doesn't really matter where you search for a neighborhood. I'm going to choose West Hartford, Connecticut. This is where my market center is located. And go ahead and hit next. And that's going to go ahead and pull in some information for us. So I'm going to keep it for the neighborhood of West Hartford in this case. We have our average home price that pulls in is $325. And I'm a little high C, so I've, I've run a, a ZMA just to make sure that these numbers are correct. It's slightly off. So I'm going to change it to make it to what it is right now. So right now we're at 355, 633. Average home prices have gone up from the last 30 days, but have gone down from the before. So I'm going to go ahead and say we're holding steady. We're just going up and down. Average sales price per square foot currently is at 163. And that as well is up and down. So we're gonna go ahead and say that is holding steady as well. Number of homes for sale. So let's go say what we have for active is 116. Active homes for sale with the average days on market currently being 80. Then we're gonna see our neighborhood features. So let's go ahead and bring in some neighborhood features for us already, but maybe into gardening isn't one of them. So let's go ahead and remove that. Because it only lets us select three, we removed one. Now it gives us this drop down to go ahead and select another one. We can go all the way through here and you just decide to pick one of them. Let's go ahead and go with Hops and Bruce. Why not? Let me come down to agent information. Now you'll see that the information already pulled in and that's gonna come right from your marketing profile. If you wanted to change out your headshot, you could name, job title, email, and phone number. And the same thing's gonna happen for your market center. So you should have your DBA, your license number, your brokerage license number, uh, owner statement, and then we can go ahead and hit next. From here, it's gonna take a few seconds, create a video for you that you can then uh, download, you can share it with your database, you can create a Facebook post or Facebook ad with it. So once it's done creating and generating this video, I'll show you really quick what it looks like. By hitting play here. So as you can see, in under five minutes, we went ahead and created and watched a one minute long video that's branded to you with all that information we just put in there. So let's go ahead and save that. And it's gonna be saved here in our library. So I'm gonna head over to my videos here. I'm gonna click on videos. And what we're gonna see is it's updated April 13th with West Hartford here. What I want to do is now share it. So three little dots here, I can download it. I can use it in a campaign, 
share on social media, rename it or delete it. So let's go ahead and share it on social media. It's gonna bring me right into campaigns where I can write some text. It's gonna have the video already here for me. I can schedule or publish immediately and what page we are gonna send it to. Now the same thing will happen is if I click on use a can in campaigns, it's gonna bring me to a paid campaign. So I would name it, other, where do I want it, set up campaign, and it's gonna go ahead and bring me into a paid ad for social media. Now, if I wanted to download it, I could do the same, download it here, and then bring it into Facebook, let's say, I can download, upload it onto my page, I'll upload it onto my personal page, I can put it in many, many different locations that I can go ahead and share with everybody. Um, one thing to note with this video is it does show it dates. We'll see here, welcome to West Hartford, and should show a date here, April 13th. So if you're gonna go ahead and use these, you could do it weekly, update it so that you're on top of the market for all of your clients and your neighborhoods, do it for multiple neighborhoods, but you wanna make sure that you're gonna stay on top of that because it's gonna give them, again, that date that this was created. Now, I hope this was easy, simple, good for you to follow along with. Now, go out, have some fun, create some videos. You don't have to necessarily be that high C like me and do all the CMAs, but you could. Make sure you have the right numbers, and uh, let me know how you make out. If you guys have any questions, make sure to drop that information down in the comment section. Hit the like button, and be sure to subscribe for more videos just like this. Have a great day.